Hey guys, it's Kanal from ktriton.com. I'm back with another product review for you guys. Uh, this time I'm reviewing Concert Heart by Project Sam. Which, by the way, I don't know if you guys know about Project Sam. It's a terrific company. Uh, they make some phobia. Uh, they make the True Strike uh, um, libraries. They're just awesome. So this is a, what's called a digital download library. It's a, kind of an exclusive product that's uh, just digital download only and it's literally just um, samples so there's no um, infrastructure uh, VST infrastructure built into this you have to load it using compact 4 so make sure that you have contact uh, excuse me contact not compact so make sure that you have contact 4 before purchasing it um, but it's an awesome sound set it's a uh, really really versatile very dynamic uh, it lets you do a lot of things and, and as a composer, it really lets me uh, let my compositions breathe in a lot of different ways, and I'll show you. Um, so what they've done is, in this sample set, they've included um, two basic uh, uh, recordings of uh, a harp, of a concert harp. One is um, just a normal recording um, in both the close and ambient mics, of, so that you can play it, so it's playable um, samples. And the other sample set is glissandos, or glissandi. Um, that you can just hit a button and it'll play an entire glissando run. So I'm going to show them both to you in a second. Um, first I'll show you the playable um, harp uh, and then I'll show you the glissandi. Okay, here it goes. So as you can see, it's got a nice uh, rich sound once you layer both the close and the ambient mics. Very delicate. Um, it's got a few key switches up top. Um, let's start with... Uh, here we go. This obviously is the main key switch. Get some harmonics. Oops, there we go. So it works nicely when you. There you get it. Um, let's see what else. Okay, so this is, uh, I think the term, it's like guitaro or something, it, I know it's, it's the, the technical term uh, is a description of, of how you play at like a guitar. Staccato. This is staccato. Uh, here we go. So they've added this really cool thing in here um, where you can, uh, it's like putting a piece of paper right by the, uh, the harp, the harp string, and it resonates, as you can hear. So it's pretty cool. They've limited the ranges quite a bit, um, which makes sense. I think they just used pure samples. There was no um, sample stretching or anything like that. 
So, uh, very cool stuff. So let me just reload it and show you the glissandi. Okay, so here are the glissandi samples. As you can see, I've once again layered the uh, ambient and the close mics. Really, you know, just like with the last set, I really hadn't tweaked them at all. I just literally loaded them up. Um, so you can do probably a little bit with the, uh, the mixing and the mastering between both of them to make it sound even better. But it sounds pretty good just as is. So here's the glissandi. You can hear a whole bunch. There's also key switches uh, with this one too. So you heard the main one. Uh, let's find. So as you can hear, um, the key switches are basically holding down. Different uh, different pedals on the harp so that you get different types of glissandi, um, and that's a pretty cool feature. I haven't really seen that before in another sample set, um, so I thought that was pretty neat. You can totally customize it. It offers you a lot of freedom as a composer um, and as a sound designer to figure out exactly the sound that you're looking for. Um, so anyway, that's Concert Harp. I absolutely love it. I highly recommend it if you um, use harp extensively or even moderately in your compositions. It really adds a whole new uh, dynamic and a whole new, new um, layer to your, um, to your sound. So uh, leave some comments or I'll check you later. Bye.